Hi, this is Andy from Blackstone Saunas and today we are going to take a video for Far North Sauna troubleshooting. So this is a Far North Saunas keypad. This is a Far North Saunas control box. This is the inside of Far North Sauna control box. The outside looks like this and this. Uh, I have been receiving far, repairing Far North Sauna for about seven years. So the number one problem that Far North Sauna get broken is the keypad. The keypad sometimes keep flashing. What I did is to unplug one of the keypad. Basically, I only hook one keypad at a time to test. Most likely, the other keypad will work. The keypad broken only takes about 2% of my total repair for Far North. By the way, the Far North Sauna also has a bigger control box, like this size bigger. For that bigger control box, the color is cream, like white. This color is gray. Um, so for that bigger control box, we don't have the same one, but for this control box plus this adapter goes here, so this control box will match the cream color bigger Far North control box. And by the way, um, if so now let's talk about the control box quickly. What could be wrong? Number one, it's about this transformer. So the transformer usually get broken due to it's tired or power surge. So we always suggest the customer unplug between each use to increase the lifespan of the transformer. I have two customers, they are very handy and they only changed the transformer. But most of them, they would uh, buy the new box. So we don't, uh, we don't sell the transformer, but if you only want to change the transformer, sure, it's an option. I previously changed one transformer and it only lasted for three months. So the other one is the motherboard. This controls the color light and uh, the temperature sensor almost never get broken. So we have the brand new Far North, Far North control box for sale. Um, we are here in Edmonton City, Canada, but we can ship to anywhere. And we already shipped to Australia. <laughs> And although Australia have different voltage, but we get them the correct one from China as well. So thank you for watching. So the in summary, the troubleshooting process is basically changing a new box. Or if you are handy, you can measure where the voltage stops. Thank you and bye.